everyone, Kalevi here and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I am really excited you guys. So I thought of this idea like a couple weeks ago and I thought it would be really fun to do like kind of a mystery Squishmallow Easter basket opening. So that's what today's video is going to be. I, you know, got a few things, compiled a couple things together, some Squishmallow blind capsules, like Micromallow things, the new series of the like Squishums blind bags, and I have some Mercari packages in there. So I'm really excited and when you guys are watching this, I'm actually out of town right now. So hopefully my videos will be back to normal. This video is a bit early because Easter is still, we're not even in the month of Easter yet. So here is the basket. I'm really proud of it, you guys. There are a couple non squish things in there, like these two peep capsule things. But other than that, it is all squish. I have a little five inch Griella here the mystery box from the Walmart box set. So there's a Mercari package crammed in there for you guys. And then in this Food for Less Kroger capsule, I have also another Mercari package. I have these Squishums, the capsule, and stickers, and more. So I'm really excited, you guys. A lot of things to open up. Obviously, it's not even the month of Easter yet, so it's a bit early to be posting this video, but I'm really excited to show you guys what I found, and I will definitely be putting in some squish hunting clips as well, like, for example, when I found this capsule, this, Griella, etc. So yeah, anyways, let's get into it. I'm really excited. All right, you guys, so here is the Easter basket that I compiled. Oh my gosh, I think it looks pretty cute, you guys. I have a lot of different things. So I do have one of these brand new Fancy Squad Squishums. It is open. I will play that clip for you guys so you guys know why. And I have a couple of these Peeps like capsules. They have little Play-Dohs in them, which is pretty cute. And then I picked up this little Mystery Squad Micromalo capsule at Winco. And I have this box filled with a tiny little Squishmallow Mercari package. Then I have a five inch Griella here that I decided to pick up for my collection at Walmart. I have some really cute stickers back here and I have an even bigger Mercari Squishmallow package in the big capsule. So I'm really excited you guys and let's just get opening. Oh my gosh, doesn't it look so fun and enticing? So which should I open first? I think I'm going to do this one right here, and I'll play the clips right now. Alright you guys, I found this monstrosity. Look at all of these. And this one was open, and so were a couple others. I can't find the others. But look at who's inside. It's Rena. Guess I'll get her. Kind of sad that it's open, but I don't need anyone from this series. I already got Connor, and then I got this Monica last time. Now all I need is Brina and she's in here. And I'm gonna look through here see if there's Brina in any of these closed ones so I don't have to buy an open one. But I guess they were looking for Monica when they found her. Alright this one's been torn up as you can see how crumbled it is but I'm going to get it because I'm really excited. I really want Brina. They are seven dollars here which isn't too bad. I'm just gonna grab this one. All right, you guys, so now you saw why it's open. So I'm really excited for who is inside and let's get it open. All right, you guys, as you can see, it was already torn open, but I'm still excited. So you guys can kind of see in the people, it's pink. So it's definitely going to be this little cutie. All right, you guys, little snippy snip on the top. Oh my gosh, it's Brina. I don't even think she has feet, what the heck? Here is Brina the Bigfoot, except she doesn't even have feet, so how can she be a Bigfoot? All right, you guys, so here are my other Squishums that I have. So I have Connor from the first series, really cute. And then I have Monica from the fantasy series. This one, of course, as you can see. I'll show you guys who else you can get. I kind of really want Baden. I did see him. I didn't pick him up though. So my collection is slowly growing. However, I don't know if I should have gotten this one. This one's kind of... She's a little bit ugly. I mean, she doesn't have her feet. Like, also she looks really faded, like, already. I don't know. And she smells horrible. Oh, holy. Wow. I did not... Oh, wow. I did not need to inhale it like that. Very chemically. Wow. 
chemical smell for sure. She does have her blush still and everything. Very cute. I mean, cute but weird. Kind of missed their mark for this one, I think. Because for Connor and Monica, they look really cute, you know? But I mean, they couldn't have put feet on her. Like, look, th this is like extended off the squish so they could totally have feet. I don't know. All right, you guys. Next, I'm thinking of doing one of these peeps little capsules. I thought it was really cute. I think the container is adorable and they are marshmallow scented. Non-edible, it says, but I can sure as heck try, right? Anyways, it comes with a dough pack and a cutter. So let's open it. All right, you guys. So I'm pretty enticed by this. Again, it was pretty cheap. I got one of every color except I did not get the blue one. But I think they're really cute just to like use, I don't know, you can maybe keep jewelry in them when you open them because the containers are really cute. Okay, that did not work. All right, let's try how it's intended. Oh my gosh, you guys. Th these guys smell so bad. Like, Rena, I can smell her. Oh my god. I'm not even that close to her. So I'm filming that I can still smell the chemicals. Okay. All right, you guys. Here it is, a naked peeps. The sticker on the bottom makes it difficult to do this. All right, so I guess it's as you expect. So it comes with a little peeps like play-doh cutter which is actually really cute look at that and here's the dough let me smell it can't really smell it through the package it's probably going to smell like chemicals and not be worth it okay well it smells like play-doh but it smells a little bit like marshmallow there we go a little peeps of course, the Play-Doh will dry out, so I definitely recommend not keeping it in here or at least putting it in a separate baggie first. I actually might get one for my friend for their little Easter basket. Anyways, that was pretty cool. All right, you guys, so what should I pick next? I think I'm going to do one of the Squishmail Mercari packages, so I think I'm going to do... Um, I'm going to do this one first, I think. The little box. So I'm pretty excited. And as you can see, it's definitely shoved in there. It barely fits. So let's get it open. Oh my gosh, I'm super excited to open this, you guys. Let's do it. As you can see, I definitely shoved it in there. And there's even cute little filler. I tried to be cute, but yeah. Anyways, I'm really excited. So we have a squish mail Mercari package in here. As you can see, it's definitely tiny. The squish itself is that small. So I'm really excited. Let's get it open, you guys. This is our first out of the two packages. Okay, and oh my gosh. Look at you guys. I finally got one of my dreams. Also, it's my first ever frog clip, so I'm really excited about that. Let's get it out of this packaging. There's even a little extra in there. I'm so excited. So here is the extra. Oh my gosh, it's like a little Pooh Bear Squishmallow Croc Gibbet. That's actually really cute. And then I got a little note. It says, thank you for purchasing. And it's on a little Karami thing. Oh my gosh, I need to get some Karami stationery. That is so cute. So thank you so much for the little extras and the note so cute and here is the squish that i found it's wendy so i can finally finish my 2022 easter squad because you guys i got everyone in this walgreens clip squad except for wendy so i now have her and again she's my first frog clip so i'm so excited you guys oh my gosh and why are her eyes so big they look massive but again, I don't think I've actually ever seen a frog squish clip in person. So I guess that's why the eyes look massive to me because like they do. But oh my gosh, her coloring is so cute. And look at her belly and she's so perfect. I'm so happy to finally have her, you guys. Again, I have everyone else in this squad. So I'm really excited to finally complete like the squad. Oh my gosh. Wow. So these two have been my dream for a while and I finally found her for a really good price. I will show you guys, but I'm pretty sure she was like probably $10 shipped and I think that is a great price, you guys. So cute. I mean, she's so cute and you guys know I love green. Oh my gosh. So she's so perfect for the Easter and spring season. That's why I definitely had to put her 
in this cute little mystery box. So that is what we got, you guys. All right, you guys, so we've already had three openings down, and now we have just a few left to open and review for you guys, but I'm still really excited. So what should we pick next, you guys? We still have the Peeps Bunny doll pack. We have this Micromello Mystery Squad. I have everyone in the squad except for the squirrel and the dinosaur, I believe. So I'm pretty excited to see who's in there, and I did randomly pick up a color without looking. So this one you can't really tell is inside, so it's a complete mystery. And then I do have 5-inch Riella to review, and these stickers, and this guy. I think I'm going to review the stickers next, actually. They're so cute. All right, you guys, so here are the stickers. So there were actually some other Easter basket stocking stuffers. Like, well, I'll actually show you guys those clips if I still have them. Look at these Squishmallow bath bombs. That's kind of cute. But I didn't really want to get any of the bath bombs or anything. Wasn't too interested. And sadly, I wish that they released like some stickers for Easter or something for Squishmallows. They did not. But at Walmart, I did find these really cute sparkly Easter spring like little animal stickers. And they were only 98 cents. This one is my favorite. Look at the raccoon. And it's like puffy stickers. Puffy, shimmery, and glittery stickers. Only a buck, you guys. I think it's totally worth it. Look at this one and a few eggs and i'm just so excited i'm definitely going to put this one on my laptop i mean like they are really good quality you guys so these are definitely worth it all right you guys so that was the stickers and now i'm going to move on to this one i'm so excited you guys still no clips all right, I am super excited, you guys, to open this little Micromalo capsule up. So, like I said, I have most of these little guys. I recently got Easton the Anglerfish, and I have this cutie, and this one, and this one, and the Mammoth. I do not think that I have the Leopard, the Squirrel, or the Little Dino. So I'm really excited to see. But anyways, let's open this one up. I think it was like five bucks at Winco. So, I'm super excited. I'm just going to do this right here. It never opens the way I want it to. I'm like, what is that? Oh my gosh. Okay. All right, guys, it's time. Let's see who we get in here. Again, you can't really see who could be in there. So it's a total mystery. Three, two, one. Oh my gosh, another Easton. He's so cute. Okay. So, yeah, I did just get an Easton recently, but you know what? I'm definitely not mad about getting Easton again. I think when they make Micromallows, it's like the scrap fabric of the other squish. I think it's definitely evident in like this guy. But anyways, I think he's still really cute. Look at him. Look at his little fins, his belly, his spots, his teeth. Look at his teeth. His little like light antenna is a little strange. Not much detail, but I mean, what could you do? But I mean, he's so cute, you guys. So that's what I got in, what, what squad is this called? I'm not sure. But that's what I got in this little blind capsule. So excited. All right, you guys. So that was definitely a fun opening. And now we only have a few more things left. We just have this Peeps, this capsule, and Griella left. Oh my gosh. I think next I'm going to do Griella. So cute. Look at her. Oh my gosh. All right, guys, so I will play the footage when I found her and decided to grab her. They have blind capsules, like I figured. This one is the little bunny, Robin. Oh my god, they have so many of the five inches. Look at that. I might actually get Griella. I said I didn't need her, but since it is a five inch, there is a difference between a four inch and five inch. And this one has more spots compared to my capsule one. And she has a tag, the Easter tag. So I think I'll grab one, I'll compare the spots. Oh, well, this one's kind of cute. I like this one with the orange spots. Well, looks like I'm just getting my 5-inch Grella. I think she's adorable, and again, I want her with an Easter tag. And she's so cute, I love her spot colors. There's a bunch of like orange and peachy colors. So I think I do want to get another Ivor from the capsule to try to make an Ivor clip. Not sure how that will work out, I'll wait though. And I just can't believe how many they have of these guys. Oh my gosh. I still kind of want Amy. I don't know. I love her green. I just got Zen in that Walmart video I mentioned. And then Bubbles, really cute. 
and then Griella, who I'm getting. And again, they all have different spots, as you can see. This one has the least blue and the most pink and orange, and it really complements her body color. All I'm getting is little five inch Griella the cow. <laughs> So when I first got her in the blind capsules, I was like, well, I don't need to pick up a 5-inch version. But I decided to because, first of all, the 5 inches have a lot more, like, colored spots on her tummy. And she is slightly bigger and she does have her hang tag. So that's why I decided to get her. She's so cute, you guys. She's only $4.98. Look at her face. I really love this version of Griella as opposed to the original version that is more darker, like her tag. I really love the pastel versions. Oh my gosh. That is Griella, you guys. Oh my gosh. Look at her little tiny fuzzy tail. Again, this is not the review part. I will do that in a little bit. So that is Griella. I love her and I'm so glad I decided to pick up a five inch version of her. All right, you guys, we are so close to the very end. The last two things is this guy and this guy. So of course I'm saving the best for last. So I'm going to open this guy up. All right, you guys, time to open up our last little peeps capsules. These are so cute. Like, I definitely think I'm going to grab a blue version. I think I do prefer the cute little peep version better than the bunny peep. I'm just going to do it like this, cut her neck. They had a bunch of peep stuff at Walmart this year, you guys. Kind of tempting, but with all the sports models I collect, I didn't want to start a new collection. Especially since they had blind bags, and it was like, I definitely didn't need to go down that route. All right. I have such a trash pile over there. But here is the bunny capsule all Nikki. Let's get it open. And it does, look at it. So it definitely does have its own cute little peep bunny cutter. Look at that. And then it has some more of the dough. All right, so here's the dough. Let's try out the cutter. That one is cute. This one looks, I think, a little bit better than the peeps one. That is so cute, you guys. I think it's worth it. So cute. And again, I got them mostly so I can keep the little capsules, the containers, for like jewelry or something. We are at the very end of the Easter Squish Basket opening. I hope you guys enjoyed so far. And let's get into the last thing, which is this massive Squishmallow mystery capsule. I'm really excited, you guys. So let's get into it. I'm really excited to open this up. Again, there is a Macari Squishmallow package inside. And let's get it open. There it is. Another Squishmallow package. This one is pretty dense, so I have no idea which one is in here, actually. And again, a bunch of fun little things. I mean, look how pretty it is. They're so shiny. All right, I need to stop. I'm super excited. Let's get this guy open. We have our final Mercari Squish package and it's time to open it up. It's totally shoved in here, you guys. Like, I don't know how they got in here and I totally don't know which one it is because, because of the fact that it's so shoved in here. Oh my gosh, you guys, I thought this one was lost in the mail. No way, that is crazy, you guys. Oh my gosh, in my last video, well, the last video I edited before this. Oh, it's this handmade with love. In the last video, I said I thought this guy was lost in the mail. But here he is. He was disguised in a tiny package, even though he's a seven inch. Oh my gosh. So cute. How did they fit him in there? Look at him. <laughs> Do you see him? Look at him. He's so silly looking. But oh my gosh, you guys. I finally got him. Let's give him some air, shall we? My dude was squished. So this is Wilfred. He's so cute. I got him for a really good price on Mercari. So that's why he does not have his tag. Also, it smells delicious. It smells like he was just in the dryer, which I'm pretty fine with. He seems pretty clean. Oh my gosh, you guys, there's something else in there. Let's see what it is. Look at how cute these are. Definitely ordered it in Valentine's Day. This definitely one ups my Easter filling. But look at what we got. Let's see in my little extra baggie. I got two little pencil top erasers, which these are actually so nice. I actually love erasers. So, and then a little heart that says, thank you, Squish Shop. Really cute. And then a little foam Jack Lantern sticker. I totally love that. And then some Jack Lantern bubbles. 
So it's so weird because there's like Halloween going on and Valentine's Day and it's Easter. Well, it's spring season, but either way, thank you so much for the extras. And I'm so happy he wasn't lost in the mail. Oh my gosh. There's so much trash, you guys. Do you see this? It's my trash pile just for the basket opening. But this is Wilfred, or is it Colton? I'm not entirely sure because he doesn't have his tag. But you guys, I am so happy to have him in my collection. He is so cute. And you guys know I have been wanting to find him at Walmart for an entire year. So I did just find him for a really good price on Mercari. Here's his cute little tail. It's not fuzzy. And his big lawn horns. So cute. And I love his little hair right here. He is adorable. So that is what our Easter basket looks at the end after everything is opened up. Look how cute everyone is. Oh my gosh. I am so happy with everything that we got, you guys. So these are all the squishes that we opened in the basket opening. And I'm first going to mention the tiny little cuties. And then on to the bigger guys. First, we have the Brina Squishum. And all I'm going to say in her review is, I mean, look at her. Doesn't she look a bit odd? A bit funky. You'd think it's because she's missing her feet, but I don't know. There's something about her that feels completely off. <laughs> Next is Easton, a tiny little micromallow. He is so adorable, you guys. Look at his little mouth. Oh my gosh. I love him, you guys. He's, I keep saying it, but he's so cute. Surprisingly, for being a micromallow, the details are really cute, you guys. Really good. And I mean, except for his little yarn that's supposed to be his little light. I mean, it could be a little bit better. Oh well, he is as cute as he can be, given the fact that I think that they do use scrap material from their squish, I'm not entirely sure. Like, do you see how it doesn't even, like, correspond? Like, the back and the front look like totally different pieces of fabric, because they are. Either way, I still think he's adorable, and I'm pretty happy to be getting him, even though he is a double. Our next squish that we got was our Flower Belly Wendy clip, my first frog clip in my collection. Look how cute she is. Is it normal for the frog clips to have these giant eyes or like is that just this windy i don't know but she's so cute her color green is gorgeous we don't really see a lot of squish with this color green of course it's like the classic windy color but it's a little bit different of a windy color i don't know how to describe it but she has her cute blush and her fabric tummy with the flowers is a really pretty design and here is her tag again i miss the old tags you guys something about them Here's the squad pick. I finally completed the squad, yay! And here is her bio. I am so enthralled about finally having her in my collection. And again, I found her for a great price. So I definitely recommend just to keep checking on Mercari. You never know when someone's going to sell a Squishmallow for a really reasonable price. And that's usually when I pick them up. So that was Wendy. Flower Belly Wendy from last year's Walgreens Clip Squad. So gorgeous. Our next squish that we got was 5 inch Griella from Walmart. She was $5.98. I'm gonna take that off now. Might as well. And I really wanted to get her. I already mentioned obviously why. Because I wanted to get her hang tag. Yeah, I don't know. I think she's really cute. I'm glad I got her for the collection. Since the only other Easter Griella I have is the capsule version, I'm not going to be getting the larger size Griella, I don't think. So I definitely wanted a different version of her in my collection. She is so cute, you guys. I've already reviewed her when I did the blind capsule opening videos, which I will link. But I still think she's adorable and I definitely had to say a few things about her. I love her pastel brown, her cute pink nose rainbow spots that everything about her is just so cute even down to her tiny little fuzzy brown tail she is the perfect little cutie and i think she's really underrated you guys and let's hop right into her bio so that is five inch griella she's so adorable i am so happy that i picked her up from walmart oh my gosh i love her little winking face so cute all right, you guys, our final squish that we got in today's video was really cute seven inch Walmart version Wilfred slash Carlton, the Longhorn cow. Look how adorable he is, you guys. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy to finally have him in my collection. I know he's not super rare, but I could not find him or Sydney for the life of me at Walmart. Like I said, I was looking for like a year all the time and I did find the Balana, a seven inch Balana, three separate times. But I never found this guy or Sydney once. I finally have him. Of course, he doesn't have a tag, which is kind of a bummer, but I figured I didn't need it because I have a few squish without tags and he was a really great price, you guys. 
he is glorious you guys he's very basic he's one of the most basic longhorns ever actually he's just brown with a little fuzzy top which is totally different than the other longhorns and they're like big fuzziness here usually and he just has a regular belly lawn horns and he is only seven inches so he's slightly smaller than typical eight inches but he is so gorgeous and you guys know that i love the brown squish and the cows and the lawn horn cows especially so that's why i'm super excited about this simple little guy so that is wilfred slash colton the seven inch from walmart and i'm so happy i got him and i could have sworn he was lost in the mail but he wasn't yay he's so cute i'm so happy all right you guys so that was everything that we opened up in our easter basket let me know down below if you guys want to see another one of these videos i think it was really fun so let me know down below if you guys think so as well also i want to show off the easter grass because i mentioned it so i'm going to show off how beautiful it is look at that you guys so cute it looks so yummy i just want to eat it all right you guys so that was the video i hope you guys enjoyed and again i am on vacation right now so if i'm not responding to comments as much or posting as much that is why but i hope you guys enjoyed this video these videos don't do the best usually on my channel but for me they're really fun i don't know some people might enjoy this type of content but yeah i also got a haircut um i kind of really want my bangs back as you can see they're really long but i just kind of trimmed and got more layers but did not trim my bangs, so let me know how you guys like it in the comments down below. Don't forget to leave a like and comment down below your favorite item that I got from the Easter basket today, whether it was a Mercari package or something from one of the blind bags or capsules. And make sure to subscribe so you guys can see what I actually get on Easter day, and I'm really excited, so I will see you guys on the next one. Bye!